Hey everybody, it's Jason again. So, um, I got on Amazon again and uh, I bought something. Um, several weeks ago, I got called down to the interstate to do some welding on an 18-wheeler at night. And, um, of course, people don't pull over to the other lane when they see, you know, a car on the side of the road. And uh, it was kind of sketchy and uh, I, I really didn't like it. So I decided then that I was going to put some strobes on my truck. And uh, what I did, let me show you this, is uh, I ordered these uh, Wee Long Winneco <laughs> uh, 10 uh, for rucks and vehicles uh, made in China okay so I don't care but this is what they are um, nice little LEDs they're about an inch and a half wide uh, maybe I don't know four four inches long um, there's six Six orange and six white LEDs, one wire coming through, and um, I'm, I'm going to tell you, uh, they're really easy to put in, but let me tell you, the instructions uh, are incorrect. It tells you to take the yellow wire and momentarily touch it to the red wire to change the strobe pattern. Well, that's wrong. Uh, touch it to the negative, and you can scroll through the different uh, patterns. I think this one had like 16 patterns or something like that. It was pretty ridiculous, the, uh, you know, different patterns that they had. And it comes with all your, you, you know, your, uh, you know, foam mounting, and the screws that they sent were trash. But uh, if you know that going into it, it's a pretty good deal. So let me tell you what I, or let me show you what I did. So on my truck, I put one right here, and I put one right here so that my truck could be seen from the side, and then I put one here. And of course, the same thing on the other side. Uh, so that it would be seen from the rear and then on the front I put one there and I put one there I was going to put them inside my grill but it would be so far in there that it would only be seen from the front these where they are now, they can easily be seen from the side as well. And I bought a 10 pack of them for about, I don't know, $35 or something like that. Um, so I've got eight of them mounted and I've got two left over. So what I'm thinking is I'm gonna put them on my mirror. Um, I think that might be kind of cool. And then if I wanted more side coverage, I could just push in my mirror and it would be right there so my truck would be seen from the side. Uh, they're super easy to install. Um, I chose to, instead of running all the wires ground, you know, um, I grounded each one, each each light I grounded to the truck um, and then I ran wires, uh, ran the hot wires all the way to the front and I got a little switch right here, right there in my truck. So uh, it turned out pretty cool. Let me turn them on uh, and show you what they look like. Um, I chose to have all my patterns the uh, same so every time so you can see the pattern um, 
Every time I installed one of the lights, uh, I have a 12 volt power supply and I went around to each one and um, touched the yellow to the ground uh, until they were all on the same pattern. And of course, being electronics, um, there's a little delay on each one. So even though they all have the same pattern, it's kind of random uh, because they don't all do the same pattern at the same time. Um, let me step back here and turn the lights out so that you can see what it looks like uh, lit up. But they are super bright and I'm really impressed with them. But check this out. I mean, if somebody doesn't see me sitting on the side of the road with these things going on, then they just really don't need to be driving it, right? I mean, they are, look at this. So now when I'm on the side of the road, um, I got called, after I installed these, I got called back down to the interstate to fix a guy's boat trailer that he was towing. Uh, he was from out of state traveling to a different state and um, uh, I didn't, you know, I got down there to the interstate, turned my lights on and I looked back and cars that were like, I don't know, half a mile away uh, were already moving over. So it wasn't as sketchy and um, I felt a lot safer by having those on there but anyway uh, $35 on Amazon um, and that's what they are super easy to install um, you know if you've got all the right wires and connectors and all that kind of stuff but let's go in here and I chose a light that I mean is a a switch that has a light on there uh, so that when I got back in my truck and I was going back down the road I would be able to see if they were on or not because um, as a service truck you're allowed to have them on there and, and you're allowed to have them going uh, when you are in the duty of your job but you can't just have these on while you're driving down the road. Just, you know, going to the grocery store or whatever. But anyway, they fit right on my, on my bars just perfectly. And um, what I decided to do, instead of using the uh, screws that it came with, that probably would have every single one of them broke, um, I cut a template out of, of a Gorilla double-sided tape and it's the same tape that I've got my GPS pod on on the top of the truck mounted with and that 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 uh, that double-sided tape from from a Gorilla is uh, super super tough uh, waterproof and everything so anyway just want to show you my lights um and the um you know don't be scared to order you know a 10 or 12 pack of these these strobes from amazon you know just because they're 35 dollars you know they're good they're good i'm pretty impressed with them and uh um if i need more lights for some reason um i won't hesitate to order you know the same brand anyway but anyway uh so thanks for watching hey please subscribe to my channel uh hit that like button but please subscribe i need some more subscribers and uh i've got a lot more content coming um i've got a lot of videos planned and we're going to do some educational stuff we're going to do some welding um, I'm still going to do that, that big review on the Vulcan, uh, 195 outlaw from Harbor Freight. I love that machine. It's, it's, it's something. It's really nice.
But uh, anyway, thanks for watching. We'll see you later.